Good afternoon, friends. September 15th, 2024. And uh, the Houthi rebels have fired a missile at Israel. And according to the Houthis, it actually struck Israel near Tel Aviv, actually just to the east of Tel Aviv there, where a power plant is at. Uh, but when you begin to look at the images that are that they're showing on where this missile actually struck there, well, let me get back to it here. Uh, it does not appear to be that this missile actually hit uh, Israel, but actually Israel shot it down. But it does clearly seem to indicate that this missile was shot down over Israeli territory. Uh, the Houthis claim that they were they sent a hypersonic missile and that they're going to send more uh, on October the 7th there. But uh, when you begin to look like here you had a little shopping mall there, glass was knocked out of the roof and things like that. Uh, this here, this video footage here was at the power plant. Uh, there are... It's, it's really, it's obvious though that this is... Uh, Wow, like shrapnel came down is what it appears to be and uh, started the fires and stuff on that uh, that uh, I think they claim that was a fuel line there uh, coming in to the power plant uh, but nonetheless still though the you know everything that I've seen thus far it does appear that Israel actually did shoot this missile down it did not uh, hit its target as uh, what's being claimed thus far there. There's even a small crater. Uh, you can see the little brush fire there. And uh, here we go right here on this one here. They're showing the uh, little, a little crater there where I guess where it actually hit the ground. But still, even if that's a blast crater, that's still not very big. I mean, it's, it's still relatively small. So... Anyway, Houthi rebels, though, do say this is only the beginning. And uh, oddly enough, there is some reports that over 20 missiles were unable to hit it. Uh, they do claim it was traveling at a Mach 5. But for Israel to be able to shoot it down, uh, that's still questionable whether or not it really was hypersonic. I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. We have more coming out today. Couple more broadcasts still yet to go. Yana will be joining me on those broadcasts there. And also, I want to share with you at 8 p.m. Eastern tonight, if you are a brand partner in LifeWave, you need to be on this meeting. Some of you are about to lose your entire uh, volume. We don't want to see that happen. We've already seen it happen with one person. So quite a few of you, probably about a dozen of you, should already be managers making even more money uh, and you just weren't attending these zoom meetings and that's what's really cost you that problem there but it can be things can be fixed and we can get this moving right for you so we want you to be there tonight 8 p.m. Eastern www.x39hub.com 8 p.m. Eastern just look in the description below you'll see it anyway thank you for joining and uh, we'll see you here in a little bit